Yeah. You doing all right, bro? Yeah. Yeah, shit. I just been shooting a lot more right now. Yeah. Okay, for sure, for sure, man. Get a little school to see what you're doing, man. Catch up with you, let the people know and shit. With your photography and shit, man. Uh, let the people know where you're coming from, bro. What, what part of Dallas you coming from? Shit, I'm in North Dallas right now, goddamn. Okay, so with your photography, how long you been doing photography and shit, bro? Shit, a little bit over a year. It wasn't really what I was trying to go for, but okay. it happened. If you got a fella in your lap and shit. Now, when I came across, you was working with Real Life Street Stars and shit, bro. Whatever happened with that? You was interning for them, right? Yeah. You still working with them and shit? What happened uh, yeah, with that? So, well, I kind of been on my on my own right now. You're working by myself, but I still be fucking with everybody in real life. Okay. I don't, what projects did you do for them? Did you work with work, work did on you work with them? So, before I even worked with Real Life, uh, I went to college for business to start a clothing So I can't take it. Uh-huh. You said you went, where did you go to school? Yeah, for business. Go ahead, Los. Um, yeah, I went to uh, high school, no, not high school, college for business to start a clothing line. And then uh, I started taking pictures, and then I went to an event. And then I did a little quick photo shoot, did a little quick video recap just to kind of test my skills. Right, right, right. Send it to the people of the right. event. And they were fucking with that shit. And that's where I met real life. And then I started shooting with those people from that event for like half a year. And then January of last year, I hit a real life. I'm like, hey, I kind of want to start shooting more. I want to learn more. I want to try to be my mentor. So y'all down. They took me to the studio. And they asked, like, we're actually looking for someone who can take pictures, shoot, edit, this, this, and this. I'm like, I'm actually knowing how to do this right now and want to learn more. Like bet, so I started working with them, and then at first, like most of the group was like, I don't know, cause we didn't know him like that. But then, uh, <clears throat> and then I started, uh, they started seeing I went to all these events, going to all these parties, clubs, shows, and they're like, okay, yeah, he working, working. So yeah, I started shooting more, and then I was editing for them. I did a couple videos, not too many, right, and right. then uh, I did a lot of their photo shoots though. So are y'all still working together at the moment, or what do y'all? What kind of relationship do y'all have at the moment? Nah, we still cool. We still family, but I mostly been kind of just trying to grow to do my own stuff. Right. Like I said, I look at them as mentors. So yeah, just been still trying to. I hit them up here and there, go to the studio here and there, but mostly I've been out of like you know, like a strip club, like yeah. a club, or doing some random shoots and shit. Now, with you, are you, is it safe to say you're the official photography man for ALD? What's your role at ALD? Well, it's funny because I went to ALD the first night with real life because they were the cameraman. And then mm -hmm. Jeff, the owner of that hoe, he was like, hey, look, come through. I'm like, bet. So I go over there. And at first, they, they were trying to cap on me because they didn't know who I was. Right, right, right. They used to get young and tired of just coming with a camera and shit to a strip club. They never been there before. They're like, okay. Nah, you can't come with the camera, but. Just said, you okay to go in? I right, go ahead, go in. And then slowly, I went from a cameraman to a promoter. And then when I'm a promoter and a high man, you know, you always see me. When they get some look at me, I be dancing in the club, turning everybody up. <laughs> nah, for sure that, for sure that, man. What's the wildest shit you ever footage, man, that you ever caught on camera? Damn, I have some shit, and I deleted that shit because cops. But I was at a hood party uh, end of 2018. And then I record, I'm recording everybody, I'm doing a recap. And I recorded people, they started just screaming out their set. And that's when the DJ had turned out the music to such a song. So everybody heard the set. And I'm like, okay, this shit might be weird. Let me just walk right to the other side. I start recording again, the DJ, whatever. And next thing you know, you hear pop, 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 everybody running, gunshots. Yeah. I, I totally forgot to turn on the camera because I had to dug the shit. And then I'm looking at my camera, looking at footage the next day. I'm like, Damn, I caught the gunshots. Ah, oh, shit. Nah, I got to delete this shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's right. Well, shit, I appreciate you tapping in with us, Los. For the people at home, man, that want to do some business with you, let them know where they can find you on social media, Twitter, Instagram, chat. <laughs> you can look me up at creator.lows, this account, or creator.lows.visuals. And then also, if y'all trying to go to the strip club party, let me know. Yeah. Big-ass party in like three weeks, so. 
When you doing when you throwing your party? In three weeks. Okay, for sure, for sure, man. Well just tap in, let us know, man. It's yeah, I already got you on the gift list. I'm just waiting to get the location set in first and then I already got like thirty like twenty girls from Houston, from out of state, ready to come through and shit. So yeah, the shit finna be lit as fuck. It's gonna be a movie. Nah, for sure, for sure. I know I only got there. Huh? One hell of a night. One night only got there. One night only. I know that's it. <laughs> well, shit, man. It's always love, man. Take care of yourself, man. Tap back in with us, man. You already know what it is. Yeah, for sure. Y'all be safe. All right, bro. You too. We appreciate it.